On October 7, 2024, Poland took a significant step forward in modernizing its military capabilities with the delivery of four Homar K launchers. This shipment is part of a broader order for 218 modules, signed in 2022, as part of Poland's ambitious efforts to enhance its artillery systems. By the end of the year, the Polish armed forces are set to receive an additional eight modules, demonstrating steady progress in integrating these advanced systems into the country's military units. The Homar K represents a Polish adaptation of the K-239 Chunmu multiple launch rocket system, initially developed by South Korea. In Poland's version, the system is mounted on a locally produced Jelx 8x8 chassis, replacing the original South Korean Doosan chassis. This move not only underscores Poland's intent to localize production, but also reinforces its strategic goal of achieving greater self-sufficiency in military equipment. Integration of the Homar K modules is taking place at the Huta Stoloa Walla, HSW factory, with local production becoming increasingly central. Under a second contract signed in April 2024, 72 additional modules will be delivered, with 60 of them being entirely built in Poland. The Homar KS adaptation goes beyond the chassis. The system boasts impressive versatility, capable of launching various rockets and ballistic missiles, including the CGR-080 guided rockets with a range of 80 kilometers and the CTM-290 short-range ballistic missiles that can strike targets up to 290 kilometers away. A GPS-assisted navigation system enhances the accuracy of these rockets, with the CGR-080 achieving a precision of 15 meters, while the CTM-290 is accurate within 2 meters. The system can also integrate unguided 122mm rockets, which are compatible with Poland's WR-40 Langusta or Soviet-era BM-21 Grad launchers. One of the most remarkable aspects of the Homar K is its firepower. Each launcher is capable of firing six 239mm rockets in just 30 seconds, creating devastating area saturation. Ongoing development efforts aim to further expand the system's capabilities, with plans to incorporate new rockets with ranges of up to 200 kilometers and even more powerful 400 mm rockets, which are currently under development. Technically, the Homar K is a formidable machine on the battlefield. Weighing in at 31 tons, the system measures 9 meters in length, 2.9 meters in width, and 3.3 meters in height. Powered by a 450 horsepower HD Hyundai Infracore DV11 K diesel engine, it can reach speeds of up to 80 km per hour and has a range of 450 km, making it both fast and flexible for operational deployment. Its transmission system, provided by Allison Transmission, allows it to navigate across challenging terrains. The Home RKS crew, consisting of three personnel, is protected by armor that meets Stanag 4569 Level 2 standards providing resistance against ballistic threats and shrapnel with the use of steel, ceramics, and polymer composites. This modernization effort is part of a broader initiative by Poland to replace its outdated Soviet-era artillery systems with cutting-edge technology. The Homar K launchers are central to this strategy. In October 2022, the Polish Armaments Agency signed a deal with Hanwha Aerospace to purchase 288 K-239 Chunmu launchers. The first modules from this agreement have already been integrated into Poland's artillery units, with continued deliveries planned. By 2029, the Polish armed forces are expected to have 290 launchers in total. In addition to the acquisition of launchers, Poland is also focusing on munitions production. In 2024, during the KDEX International Defense Exhibition, WB Group, a leading Polish defense contractor, and Hanwha Aerospace signed a joint venture agreement to locally produce CGR-080 rockets. This initiative is another step towards achieving strategic autonomy for Poland in munitions manufacturing, while solidifying the country's defense partnership with South Korea. The delivery of four Homar K launchers on October 7 marks a pivotal moment in Poland's artillery modernization program. These launchers, part of the 218 module order, are already being integrated into the 1st Artillery Regiment and the 18th Artillery Brigade, with more deliveries to follow. As the modernization program progresses, Poland is rapidly positioning itself as one of the most advanced artillery forces in Europe, with capabilities that are on par with the most modern armies on the continent.